What's up guys, back again to the channel. So guys, these are all the DC, the DC projects, as in movies and shows, um, um, that are releasing in 2024, which we are not getting that much, but we're getting a good handful to keep us busy with DC content, you know what I'm saying? So yeah, so, so we're getting Joker 2, which I am so so excited for i am insanely excited for it. guys i don't know if, i i think i mentioned this on the channel before but the first joker movie was so like game changing to like the comic book movie genre it like to some people it's not even a comic book movie it's just a masterpiece of a movie guys so right the first the first movie um it, it basically was coming out basically post the suicide the first suicide squad movie and i looked at the trailer and i was like wait that's not jared leto i was like whatever like whatever they're just like at that point i was kind of like a bit ups not upset but like a bit upset at dc because they, they was kind of like recast sometimes and they kind of do other stuff i'm saying so like i'm like whatever um i'm like whatever i'll wait for this movie to come on dvd or like at the time dvd i was like whatever or streaming whatever right and and we were getting close to the film we actually it was like the opening weekend for the film right it was the opening weekend right and one day my big brother he was the my big brother he decided he wanted to go right and and my uncle was like yo alex do you, do you want to go too and i was like I, I that's the thing about me i will never say no to a movie that's how i seen the that's how i seen scream five you know what i'm saying i'll never say no to going to the movies if, if there's a chance to go to the movies i'm going i don't care if it's a, the i don't care if it's a kid movie i don't care what type of movie it's I'm going just like how I saw Barbie, just like how I saw the trolls, uh, worlds being together. I never say no to a movie, but yeah, guys, I saw I, I went to see the movie. I was like, well, but sure, why not? It's Joker, why not? Let's just see, let's just, might as well. I sent theaters, I'm watching it. I came out with a whole new mindset, guys. Like, I came into this, like, like y'all, there's gonna be no Batman because they want it to be like a Joker origin film. I was like, this movie's gonna probably be like a bit boring, but I'll deal with it, right? No, this movie was a masterpiece. A masterpiece. This movie, this movie literally showed you don't need like action scenes. You don't need, you don't need cr like crazy fight scenes with big bad guys or, or, or like all that stuff. As much as I, I love that type of stuff, I love that type of stuff in the comic book movie genre. But this shown that you don't need that. I mean, no, I mean, majority of the comic uh, films, you do kind of need that. But for this film, it just showed that, like, it was just a regular origin film for a comic book movie, which I found very, very interesting. And I'm so hyped for Joker 2. The only thing, my, my expectations were my hype for Joker 2, because with my bro, Gadiel, like, guys, we, like, ever since the, after Joker 1, We've been debating for the longest time, for years and years and years. We want, we wanted a Joker too. We wanted a Joker too. And at some point, we're kind of like, "Yo, does Joker really need a sequel? Does Joker need a sequel? It was, it's kind of just a good film on its own." And this movie has a lot of weight on its shoulder because it, it the first film was such a masterpiece. It was so epic that 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 this movie needs to, this movie needs to exceed the first film in order to even be as good if it if it's if it's like this people are gonna be like yeah, i watched joker the second joker movie but it's not as good as the first one that i don't want that you know what i'm saying i want this film to be even better and and it's such a like the first one's such a masterpiece this one needs to reach that level and lady gaga is now in it and it's apparently gonna be a musical which is kind of like oh you serious but 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 i believe in the director todd phillips i believe in walking phoenix and this is the first sequel walking phoenix has ever done he's never done sequels so that's how you know walking phoenix must have looked at the script and said yo you know what i'll do it i'll do a sequel for the first time in my life so yeah guys um second dc project i mean the first of that we're getting joker another dc project we're getting is most likely the penguin show they have resumed f filming uh, post the strike and now that's new year i'm assuming they're gonna probably try to finish filming i think this it, it's not 100 percent confirmed but the way each every time i log on hbo max and i press a movie or show it shows me these bunch of ads of stuff that's coming and it always shows the penguin show so they must be a good handful done to be confident enough for the penguin to be releasing in 2024 but it's not 100 but i'm 100 sure that's the case but yeah guys um 
the penguin show that is set in the batman universe which is going to expand on the the crime it within gotham you know what i'm saying but yeah um these next two film the next two stuff are animated films but they're still filmed so i'm pretty excited for these so, um as as you guys know justice league crisis on infinite earths uh it's being said that uh part one i already know part one is coming out in january but it's being said that part two and three are coming out next year also so all three of those movies are coming out within the same exact year so i'm pretty i'm pretty excited for that i'm pretty excited for that i cannot wait to see cannot wait to see uh christ on infinite earths you guys uh, watch my video if you guys want to know how excited i am for that and then another movie that is coming out another animated movie that's coming out is watchmen dc is making the animated watchmen movie which oh my god i am so so excited for i cannot wait as soon as that drops bing bing watching it i'm watching it. i'm watching it but yeah guys i cannot wait for the watchmen anime series um and guys um I, it's undetermined about Superman and Lois, Superman and Lois season four. It's undetermined if that is 100% coming out this year, this year, but, but it, but I'm sure somehow it's gonna, they, 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 they said they're gonna start filming this year. And I know how fast, like, like, cause like usually, usually when they, when they film, if they finish the first episode, they'll premiere the first episode and they'll film the series as they're going they'll just be you can just expect a lot of breaks in between the episodes when that's the case but yeah guys i am very excited for 2024 dc it's nothing too crazy um nothing too crazy but we're still getting a good handful of stuff that is very exciting very anticipated uh, very something to be anticipated about stuff to be anticipated about you know what i'm saying but yeah guys let me know what, let me know what you guys think in the comments down below are you guys excited for all these projects let me know what you guys think if you guys can please smash the like button please subscribe and until next time guys peace and take care